Welcome to this new tutorial video, where we will show you how to play with the newest version of the 1.6 community patch. This video will cover only the basic elements of the new patch. In a future video we'll cover more advanced features. First of all, make sure that you select both the 1.6 patch and the 1.6 game data mod in order to play. Also, make sure to select all the proper graphical options in the game room. The community patch has the language set to English by default. In order to change the language, navigate to the patch options and select the language you desire. Be sure to select only one language at a time. When you change the language and launch the game, you will notice that the game closes immediately. This is normal, it's the patch changing the language. If you set a language different from English, this process will happen after every update of the mod. Make sure to start a game on your own before playing with others so that the language change is applied. When you configure your own hotkeys, they will be stored inside the mods folder in a file called player1.hki. We recommend that you copy this file and overwrite the one in the root Age of Empires 2 folder. This way, it won't be deleted with future updates. The mod comes with the original game interface by default. However, we recommend that you try the new advanced interface, unless your computer experiences problems. This new interface includes the villager distribution per resource and the global production queue. In order to see the global queue, you need to enable the help option in the game, that displays extended descriptions of units. This can be done via a button next to the minimap or by pressing F1. Thanks for watching.